Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, Mark Verdell Creations. Um, today's a special painting for me. Uh, I've promised a friend of mine for a while now that I was going to make her a painting. And she likes dolphins. And um, my friend, she, she really helped me out last year uh, around Christmas time. She set me up with a gallery that brought me a lot of business. And I, it really did a lot for me. And I, I wanted to thank her by uh doing this painting for her. so sharon this is your painting this was this is the one for you sorry it's so late never tried anything like this before hope it's gonna go good so here we go okay i've got a got my uh 14 by 18 i think it is canvas and uh maybe 12 by 16 uh and um what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna put this sky blue color that i've came up with myself uh by using uh let's see i use this uh turquoise blue and titanium white mixed them together and then water to consistency okay so that's going to be our background color and what we're going to do is um a ocean wave coming up and out and the dolphins are going to be coming out of the wave and what i did for my dolphins is uh um i printed out uh some dolphin images off my computer and then i cut them out and i traced them onto tape and then i cut them out of the tape and i use these for stencils so my dolphins are going to come out just white okay and uh so anyway that's how i came up with my dolphin stencils and so before we get started we need to place our dolphins where about where we want them to be jumping out of the wave so here we go and i've never done this before and i hope it goes good and uh so i hope everybody's doing good today uh i'm doing pretty good it's saturday and i'm ready to paint oops uh, sometimes cutting these things out don't go exactly how you want it to Okay, this guy looks like he's fully out of the water, so I want to put him up here high about, yeah, about right in here. Okay. I'm going to lay your dolphins out before you put your your background down. Now then, um, I was inspired to do this style by uh, a lady that runs a channel called AB Creative, and uh, she did a she did a painting like this, and that's where I got the idea. And her was <laughs> I loved it, so I hope mine comes out. I really hope it does. Okay, we'll see. I'm sure it's going to. We'll make it work. All right. Okay, there's our first dolphin. I have a dolphin here that his tail, you don't see it. So we're going to have him uh, coming down up out of the bottom of the wave. We're not, we're not going to see the bottom of his tail. So we we'll want him down low. So we want a picture about where our wave's going to curl so we want to have him his the bottom of him about right here okay oh it's scary get these things off whatever you put them on your stencil because you don't want to tear it <laughs> Oh, come on. Okay. Ok, 
Okay. All right, we have two more dolphins we're going to put down. So I'm with the with the um, where the stencils are. I'm going to leave them that bare, and then I'm going to come back and paint them in white uh, with with a brush. And so some of the stuff that don't exactly look right, I'll be able to fix with with my my paintbrush when I color it all back in okay now then we got one more little bitty baby baby dolphin okay and he's like Coming up out of here, he's wanting to hang with the big dogs a little bit. Okay. Alright. There's our dolphins in place. Now we're going to lay down our background. For that, I mixed together what I call sky blue. This is what I mixed up uh, from my, uh, uh, this was Amsterdam uh, turquoise blue and Amsterdam uh, titanium white. And all my paints were mixed up with blue and water. Uh, about 70-30% uh, was a mixture. 70% glue, 30% water. And then water to thin. And then you add that PM to your paints almost half and half, and then water to, to thin. All right. So, I'm going to lay down this. All right. And I'm wanting to leave a little bit around the tape so I know kind of where, uh, where my uh, dolphins are. Let me move some of that. Yeah. Oh, okay. Put a little too much paint on there. <laughs> Let's see here.
<sighs> now we cover it up on the lines. That's right. We can uncover them. Okay. Let's do touch up work now. Make sure I get all my sides painted up so there's no canvas showing anywhere. Don't worry about the rough look right now. That's all gonna it's gonna dry flat and it and this is just while it's wet. Okay. Hope everybody's doing great today. Uh let's see here. Well, the Mavs gave it a good shot, but just didn't quite make it. I was really rooting for them. So, I don't know what you, I, I'm for the Celtics right now. I'm hoping they make it through. And maybe I'll have, I have several teams that I really like. So, you know, I always got that spare. All right. Uh, I'm just taking the paint that I pushed off and using it to get all my sides. Oh no, look what I just did. Do you see how easy it is to screw something up? Oh my god. Especially for me. Oh. Okay. Okay, I think that's it. Alright. I'm gonna. Fill out my dolphins a little bit so I know pretty much where they are. Okay. Paper towel. Okay. My little baby dolphin. Okay. There's that dolphin. And there's that dolphin. All right. Okay. Now we're going to lay out, lay out our watercolors. And it's going to come down here. And then we're going to have a stream to come up. So after we get all our colors down, we're going to swap with white. And uh, a little bit. We want to keep it darker down here. Use more white to swipe with when you get up top so that the the white cell activator will stay a lot. It will look like foamy areas of the wave coming up. That's that's what we're going to try for anyway. Ha! <laughs> okay. Let's see here. All right, the first color we're going to lay down here is uh, Phthalo Blue by Liquitex Basics. Next is Primary Cyan, and this is by Amsterdam.
Okay. Next is Turquoise Blue by Amsterdam. Put a little bit more of this phthalo blue up in here. Okay. I'm going to put a little bit of silver up in here just to give a little bit of iridescence, a little shimmer here and there. And then I'm going to come back and I'm going to put a little white with that silver and uh it should have a pretty cool effect okay all right our next color is peacock pearl that's by deco art Okay. Our last color is Aqua, and this is by Essentials. Okay. Got to make a cell activator. Let me pause you real quick. Okay, I'm back. Um, we're going to swap uh, the bottom part. I'm going to swap with Payne's Gray with some white with it. And then as we move up, I'm going to move into just only white uh, uh, cell activator. But for a little bit, I'm going to use white and Payne's Gray both. Maybe even just Payne's Gray on the very first one on the bottom down here. Okay, so here we go with our swapping. Uh, man, I hope this comes out good because I really want to do her something nice because she really, really did me a good, good thing. This is just the Payne's Gray, and we're just going to swap it once with it by itself. Okay. Alright, I'm liking that. Okay. Um... I want to try to do something with this little part of it. Anyway, that looks better. Okay. Um, we're going to swap now with narrower uh, cards, about half this. Half the width, and we're going to swap with both the white and the, the Payne's Gray cell activator. Um, I'd like to this be a little darker here. I think I'm going to put a little blue down here, and I'm going to swap that again. Just the two darker blues. 
Okay. Um, I'm going to swap that with just Payne's Gray also. Oh yeah, that's pretty cool. That gives it a little darkness. Okay, I like that. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> Allergy time. Yay. Okay, uh, now then, let's do some of the paints gray and white. I'm going to lay the white first and then the paints gray behind it and we'll see how that goes. Okay. Okay, I'm running out of cell activator, so I'm probably going to start swapping halfway and then swapping halfway with a fresh one because I'm losing my cells. But these look really good down here. Um, I'll try to remember to give y'all a close up. Uh, I get excited sometimes and end the video without the close up. Uh, I got a little spot right here I want to. that covered up all right okay we're gonna do that again do the white first I think that came out pretty good so the whites in front and the back the blacks behind okay here we go. Like I said, we're only going to go about halfway. Right there. Alright. Now that we're going to put fresh cell activator on and we'll finish it up okay oh yeah that's cool Um, I want to drag some of this paint up around here so I can make areas where it looks like they're coming out of. Okay, let's see here. I think we'll do 
the same colors one more time on the swap. I'm locking this. Uh, I'm making jewelry now too. I'm, I'll have a video coming up here real shortly showing the new video, uh, new jewelry I'm making. Uh, so I'll make I make a refrigerator magnet, magnets, <laughs> magnets, <laughs> refrigerator magnets, and necklaces and matching earrings, and uh, it's really fun. So here pretty soon I'll be showing a video how I'm doing that stuff. All right, let's go back to a card. Same thing, right in front. And black, uh, paints gray and battle and then back. Blah. Okay. And here we go. Okay. Okay, uh, one more. Okay. Okay, I'd like to swap a little bit more through there again. Uh, with mostly white. So I'm going to swap through here again with a little bit of the gray, but mostly the white. Just a tiny bit of the gray. Let's go back to here again. some up in here uh, so Okay. I hope you get a chance to see this, Sharon, if you're watching it right now. What do you think so far? <laughs> uh, I'm liking it. I've never done this before, but I'm liking this. It's 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 pretty fun. Okay. All right. Let's see here. Um, from here on out, I think I'm going to do white only on my swaps, and maybe we'll have a pretty good wave here. Okay. All right, here we go. Maybe I should just do tiny tiny line of paint gray just a tiny all right let's go up in here okay. let's do some more 
just titanium black. Just titanium white. Um, so I'm being real quiet on this one. Of, I'm actually having to try to think. <laughs> oh, it hurts. Oh, oh. Okay. I want some really white through there. So, so. Do it again. All right. And that's... Uh, I just screwed it up. I just screwed it up. Okay. And what happens when you screw it up? You go back and you fix it. Okay, let's put some fresh paint right through here. Okay, let's put some of this peacock pearl through there. Uh, yeah, let's swap that again. Same two colors. All right. Let's see, I ain't done yet. I'm gonna do a little more. Put a little bit more of this white here.
Oh, man. I keep on forgetting about talking. Usually I have no problem with that, huh? <laughs> um, this is this is different. I'm, I'm liking this. Oh, crap. I just touched some paint. Okay. I'm going to touch it right there. It looks cool. I'm going to leave it. thing on at the very front. Oh, I'm a mess. Okay. Some more cards, real quick. We're almost done. Yeah, you have to wait till later to see the final results of this, because I've got to let it dry before I take off the the uh, decals for the dolphins. So there'll be a part two. <laughs> till I get some software where I can splice stuff together, and somebody shows me how to do that. I don't, I don't know how to do it, so. But I would really appreciate anybody's help on something like that. Okay. Sometimes it doesn't work out. Oh, shit. Okay. Give me a little bit of pain here. All right, let's try this again. Sharon, I think we're going to end up with something cool, man. I hope so. We'll see.
Much thanks to the lady that has the channel AB Creative. Uh, I love the style that you did, and it's, I see it's, it is very fun. I love it. You can get very creative. Uh, I can see you can go a lot of ways with this. Uh, really cool. Uh, actually, no, that card's too big. I need some other big ones. Unfortunately, I have to let it try before I can go any farther. So, we're almost done here. Let's see here. A few more little tweaks. But where? You know what? I'm very good with it for right now. I think I'm going to let it dry and do the rest of it with a paintbrush because this has came out really cool. Uh, well, I think. Uh, I hope my I hope my friend likes it. Um, we'll see when it dries. Everything's going to dry a lot darker. Than what you're seeing now, I'm sure. Um, so let's let's wait and see how it dries, and I'm excited. I think I think this is really gonna go good. Okay. Well, as always, uh, thank you for coming and visiting me my channel, and uh, uh, thank you again, Sharon, for hooking me up with the gallery and brought me a lot of business and i appreciate you and so i wanted to do this painting for you so this is for you i know it's not finished yet but um it's going to be finished soon it's going to take a couple of days really for it to dry good and then we'll be back on it and then i'll be bringing it back up there to the to the bar with you okay well again thank y'all very much god bless and i'll see till next time i'll see you later Bye bye